Hey there guys, it's Metro and we're back. Back again. Maybe the last episode for a while, guys. Guess you'll find out, I don't know. Fucking gorgeous, man. This expansion is just, look at this. Look at this expansion, dude. Just the best looking game. How crazy good is this game, man? Dragonflight, man. Uh, it's gonna be missed, man. I'm telling you right now, it's gonna be missed. How are we doing on rep here? Let's just finish the campaign. I don't even know what these are. I've never done some of these quest lines or not. Particularly, like, I'm not really trying to do quests I've never done before like that. Let's go and try to get a campaign done. Well, first of all, let's go do that. That one's on the list to get done. She is. It's going to be probably a day and two hours longer before I come back. Getting free gold, we'll take it. It is an excellent day for a race. Or we're, fly with us. We're, get, we're, we're doing a little work for the gold, but it's not commensurate with the amount of gold. Oh, it's one of these guys. These are not actual races, right? Like, do these? Does it matter how fast you go? I don't even know. I think they are actually. Just not the same kind of race. Since we got silver, so it's a quest here apparently as well. A lot of quests in the game, man. That's why Dragonflight's gonna be such a gem to level through, because you're gonna be able to just go and just chill in zones, dude. There's so much, so much content in some of these zones. Greetings. Pro like I, I definitely okay. We definitely gotta do this again. And we definitely gotta try to see how far as your as your vault or as your span only takes us. That we gotta do for sure. Greetings. Go well. Definitely wanna try that out. This is sacred land. Quest too, I don't know. I was just like killing individual people. Why is there still crickets playing? It's nine o'clock. Talked about this before, I think it's the server. My family Pick them up, I don't know, man. There's so many freaking quests, I don't know. Um I don't know. Definitely are not going to need to do all of them to get exalted, so. You return. Have you relayed my orders? Farewell. I should warn you. Boku has a bit of a self confidence problem. Rest assured, he's an excellent mystic. I think. <laughs> Onara, where is your son? Place the totems while I try again to commune with Onara. Onara, heed me. Your people need you. Have I offended you, Windmother? I am just a lonely initiate. I need your guidance. I hear nothing. I am not fit to be a mystic. We got a new Meet spell. Eyes of the Beast. Okay. I will guide you to Ridgewater Retreat. It's 29. 30, we should get a new PvP talent slot, I think, right? So we'll just reconvene at that point and take a look at what we got. Search for Boku. So we're at 22 and a half, pretty much. So yeah, I should definitely 
We'll be uh, exalted in no time. Maybe today. Didn't even see that there. I was like, what is that thing next to my character? Then I realized it was a mechanic. See, if this level of gameplay and activity could exist in a world where the mobs actually, ha like, you know, with the, the actual danger, some packs, like, there's that mob could have killed me, right? It could have easily killed me. It had multiple mechanics that it was shooting at me. But I don't take enough damage for it to kill me, even in this state, right? I'm not naked, but I do have very little gear on. But if I had the ability to make myself take more damage, that's why I really, a long time ago, we talked about something called Mythic Plus Leveling. I made a whole video on it. I think it was for the Shadowlands, BlizzCon. I was hoping they were going to announce something like that. Basically a feature where, you know, you have control over your leveling progression. Like, more than nothing. Because right now it's basically just nothing. Wouldn't really say you have control over it one way or the other because it's just nothing. There's no way to progress as a leveling character other than gain levels and put gear on. So if there was a way to like make everything, this is the way I, I labeled it and I think this would work well. Basically, just like Mythic Plus, if I want to do Mythic Plus leveling plus one, it goes, this mod becomes 29. Well, bad example, but you know what I mean. It gains one level. And then, you know, you can just keep going. And there could even be things like fixes where you know, mobs bolster to try to, you know, think more. Like, just something like that. I think I literally just take all the affixes they removed and add them to leveling or something like that. I think it'd be really interesting. It's just, there's no real end game. Like, it's not going to be a gameplay loop anybody ever cares about. So, we would have to, you know, this would be like a public, this would be like a private thing that I would be able to do. And that's kind of what I've been trying to do on the classic server. Um, but yeah, anyway, that would be my goal, like, just to make leveling more hard, I guess. Because it's relatively disappointing at times. We have to do all these challenges just for it to not be... Not for me to just run around and just aggro everything, you know? And this one is working out very, very, very well. This is the best I think it's gone. The best it's ever gone was the Outlaw Rogue. The Naked Outlaw Rogue. That was tier one number one in terms of like difficulty to skill requirement. But I think this is the one that I'm the most surprised by. It's range Survival Hunter. Usually when you do these like limitation challenges, like I've done two-handed enhanced shaman and stuff like that. It's usually not fun. It's usually just you're just limiting yourself. You're, you're just limiting yourself. You know what I mean? It's not necessarily engaging. Like it's not a very engaging playstyle. But this is actually like perfect. This really is perfect. I could probably have. I probably could also do this naked and not. I might have to give it a try. Naked, but with full talents too. I might give it a try. Honestly, I might come back to this at some point because this is actually really, really good. I don't know that there's any other towns that would help that much, but there's at least a few other ones like that, right? That seems cool. Although I don't know what, oh, yeah. I assume it's working. Yeah, it's got to be working. Quick shot. And then it would just do explosive shot instead. So like that. Wildfire bomb deals damage. Kill command reduces the cooldown of wildfire bomb. Yeah, there's a lot of talents that could help with this. I think those actually have experience, those ones, right? Those random chests that aren't on the map.
Yeah, this is a test run for an eventual naked leveling challenge character, 100%. More hunter content coming. It's just hunter and rogue are just too fun to level, man. I really want to level Paladin more, but it's just so fucking easy. Paladin would be like the thing I think I would enjoy the most, but it's just impossible to play a pal like even naked, fully naked, it's still joke mode. It's been a long time since I've done it, but it, yeah, last time we did it, it was just very dissatisfying. That gave experience, didn't it? I think I saw experience. Look at this sky. Oh my god, look at how good this is. Oh my god, it's amazing. That's stunned. God, this is fucking gorgeous, dude. Red sky and morning, though. That's not what you... That's sailor take warning, right? That's not good. It's good for us, though, because it's amazing. I am amazing looking. Task. Should it not fall to you? By your leave. Uh, all right. I will wait. find Onara. I have faith. So we gain about a quarter of a level of rep from those quests. Kind of plan out if we're gonna need how much more we're gonna need of this. Looks like we're probably gonna have to do a few extra quest lines besides the campaign. Something is at the top of the rise. I still really don't like the ending of this campaign. Meet me up there. Wait, what am I even doing? Why am I killing these guys? I never turned this quest in. Oh, that's because he wasn't there. I remember now. These guys don't... Are these guys for anything? Why am I killing these guys? There's a bonus objective here too or something? They're not for anything, I don't think. This area I really don't like at all. I swear there's a bonus objective here. Oh, there is this, though, to kill the rare. Wow, that was a big damage source.
Don't know what that is. Increasing its casting speed, that's not great. Get rid of one every time. Looks like it was gonna drop there even without us doing anything. that give wow very little oh wait just kidding it gave like two sources of it i reacted to the first chunk but that was just from killing the actual enemy new transmog from that i guess What's up, full pure? I thought I was fighting like a little elemental. I'm like, why is this elemental making these weird noises? It's a full pure, bro. Crazy. Oh, wow. That's not what we want. I thought you died really quick. Even though his extra auto attacks didn't really help me, that's weird. Nah, it's just not gonna work. The bomb breaks it. I shouldn't have done it. I should just feigned it. I didn't need to fight that mob. Is that there again? Oh, what the hell? What is this? A second? What is that? Did he summon that? What is that mob? Alright, that was a little bit of experience too, I guess. It's weird, I don't... I don't know if I ever ran into that mob in this area, but I guess it's probably always here. Alright, we got some stuff. I'm not going to use that. I don't think I'll use... Now that we've gotten so much gear, I'm not going to use any stuff from rares anymore. If it's not BOE, we'll stick to the original rule. If it's not BOE, we don't use it. Because we've gotten a good amount of gear, and uh, I feel very powerful right now, so...
I was there. More rousing air. I mean, we really should not be just walking by all these things that can make money. This area is just too dense. It's annoying to fight at all. It's sad that like the ending of both of these zones, and really even all four zones, I'd say the endings are not very good. As soon as you introduce like the primalist stuff, it becomes a lot less interesting. And I think it's because the zone starts to like fundamentally change at that point. Like this is a completely different atmosphere than what the rest of the zone has. Or the wagons. There's only a, a few in a few spots, right? Oh, there's a chest there. Lightning bound chest. Huh. Let's we'll get that too. I'm about to ding from this, so let's go ahead and pull that. This ain't classic. I'm trying to like maximize my kills, but it's not going to really work that way. Because every time you level, you fully gain all your resources, so. Wait, that didn't count? What happened? I didn't click it all the way, I guess? Now we're about to fight another mob. Quickly, let's get this chest and see what happens. Pay attention for experience. Uh, yeah, I gave experience. Alright, well, we're level 30. Let's just go ahead and finish up this area. How Actually, we can... Possible? There's like a little area over here we can just stand for a second. Follow your heart. Follow me. Let's take a look. We must free Onara. So we got... Oh, Chimeral String. Alright, perfect, perfect, perfect. Alright, that's definitely this getting used. So keep the guards busy. Nothing else. My, what's happening there? It's right on my bars. Did I just miss? What was that? Yeah, actually, uh, that was interesting. It, it basically canceled its cast because I feigned death. That was surprising. Okay, this is getting a little difficult. Is that mob helping? No. Go. We will succeed. 
I think you just have to finish it, right? You don't have to actually kill all the enemies. I guess I'm wrong about that. Oh, I thought I just died. You were awake. I am glad to see quickly. You must tell the Kanamatra all that has happened. All right. God, look at this game, man. How is this not the best one? It's the best one. I mean, you guys are like, dude, seriously. I don't even want to, don't even bother. Like, I would say, like, don't even bother. It's just not going to work. Like, you can't convince me. I've seen too much evidence. I'm sorry. Welcome back to Marokai. What news? Welcome back, yeah. Greetings. Not much, you haven't missed much. Outnumbered. And without Onora. All right, so that's the end of the campaign, our, right? Your clan is as motivated as ever, Sansotcom. Huh. Enter Tommel. The Khans eagerly await your report. I have to actually wait, I guess. You know. Honored Khans, we have spotted a war band in Nakud <laughs> headed toward the Horn of Dressor. Balakar <sighs> is leading them himself. Balakar. Oh shit. How large is the warband? That's a full instance. Be wary. This might be a diversion. Enough to overwhelm the village at the base of the hill, but far from all their forces. What of Coraleth? Have you seen her? Or Onara? No, not yet. We are still looking for them. We must assume the Nokud want to destroy the Horn to prevent us from calling the Green Dragons. Sansok is correct. This may be a diversion. We cannot commit all of our forces. Even if it is oh yeah, no, this is yeah. We still got a little bit left here because now we gotta go to the Green Dragon part. I will take the Let's go turn this in though. Hopefully we can turn this in now. That's even more quests. Is that because we gained more rep or something? Hold your dog. I don't even know what that was. Hunting tactics. I think that's like the buff you get from getting rep, right? Yeah, we're 23 now, so that was another perk. Well then. Ah, just in time for the Turn these in too. That should get us good. Good amount of rep there, good. Should we just finish that quest? I think this is the end of it, isn't it? What roads have you traveled? Stay sharp. Maybe not. I'm just gonna keep going with the campaign for now. We'll see what actually happens when we finish it. with the outsider stay and defend this these uh these mobs fight. help me right the NPC this helps yeah should be pretty easy food. then this isn't even like Naka doesn't even take place here right it's down here here and here right confusing actually you don't really the map doesn't make a lot of sense. I've also been keeping an eye on the... Uh... See, the thing is, I don't even own the expansion, but... I've been keeping an eye on the uh, Elden Ring developments with the new expansion, the Convergence mod. They're finally getting it, like... It now works with the expansion. Not like I haven't. I don't know why it's even popped in my head, but someday I do want to play some of that on Ace Games TV. So we'll see. But yeah, with WoW's expansion coming out, I can't imagine it's 
it's a pipe dream. We got basically two weeks to do stuff that I don't even have. Like, I barely have enough time to do the stuff I'm currently doing. I really haven't, I haven't felt like this has been fast though. I guess I'm, now is usually when it would start getting fast, so. Usually 40 to 60 is like easier than 20 to 40 or 10 to 40 really. So we'll see what uh, what this looks like from here on out. Yeah, I think Autolu just has to stay off though. What will you oh, I also, uh, yeah, I also learned about, Wildhead's are posting about it, that there's actually, like, transmog from the event, the pre-patch event, that is, like, only from that. That's kind of unfortunate, because I don't, if I, if it was, a, like, I, the, the shields are what I want, dude. There's shields on there, if you haven't seen them. Man, they're fucking good looking. I'm gonna probably have to just make a level 10 warrior and just go out there and do it. Just take like a heritage armor or a, um, you know, whatever they're called, a uh, allied race out there. Okay, this is probably the last kill we need. We have saved who we can. We must get through Balakar's lieutenant, Karin, to reach the horn. Come and try it, little Khan of Matra! The primaries have made me strong! Are you not helping me anymore? Hey, he feigned death too. <laughs> that was weird. Check for transmogs too. We should honestly keep a look, keep a look at the grays as well. Really don't like that interrupt icon thing. I don't know why they did that. It looks really out of place compared to the other stuff in the game like that. What will you ask? Ganamotra. Was that the horn of Drasol? It was loud enough to wake the dead. Okay. Probably, yeah, I guess definitely not getting 25 from just a campaign. Marithra, we mean you no harm. The death of your brethren saddens our hearts. So we missed something. I never really paid attention to the cutscenes. Balakar did this. Balakar and his clan, the Nokud. They have shown their weakness and their cowardice by working with the primalists. We hope to resolve our civil war. Now I see there is only one path forward. We must vanquish them. Three clans stand with you, daughter of the dream. Sirai, Shikar, Onir. You must join me to repel the warmongers from our land. I accept your offer to stand with us, Kanamatra. My kin's sacrifice will not be forgotten. We fight together. Greetings. The dream must be protected. Find anything interesting? Yeah, this last part. I, honestly, I might just skip this last part. Because this part really sucks. Even as a tank, I feel like this was Shortly a pain in the ass part. We returned to our ancient grove to the west. The primalists attacked. We 
destroyed them time and again. The primalists knew they needed the centaur on their side to defeat us. Clan Melkud's dragon killer ballista is the key to their victory. The Nakud are relentless. With their help, Korolev's primalist army has found a way to break our defenses. The barrier to the ancient bow must not fall. Within it lies our portal to the Emerald Dream. I shudder to think what they wish to do to it. Our sanctuary lies ahead. Meet me there. We will rally the remainder of our forces. Turn this in and then I'm probably just going to go and do the rest of the complete. What? Definitely can't do that one. But presumably all these other ones give rep. It's also quests here apparently I don't remember these what would you ask of me just make me think this though that they're not really uh know that you speak with my voice. probably not gonna no, I think those give it all right quickly. well let's quickly do this because this is no combat hundred rep looks like you could all use some resources <clears throat> there's a saying for this it survival of the fittest Thing just from flying around there. Oh. Tell me to actually click on that dialogue option. never going to why would the aspects watch over they can't they just can't are they gonna watch over every single person Hello, champion. another hundred rep I'll do this quick I guess Well then, trust your- A report? Ha! <laughs> a report is that the rear flank is secure. You stand amidst the carnage that secured our victory. See those stone pillars? They are part of a barrier that keeps anyone from approaching. We must protect them, or the island's defenses will fall. Oh, right. It's... Okay. The primalists have not only enhanced the Nokud's abilities, but also join their ranks. Look at the size of those stormbound colossi. This does not bode well for us. The portal must lead to where the primalist reinforcements await. I wonder if slaying those summoners would disrupt it. Perhaps it would collapse. Quickly, Avara, return before they see you. Return to the winds of our blessed child of our world. The daughters of Tira okay. smile. That's the end. I'm not doing this. I hate this part. Keeps a lot. Oh, that's eight and a half K. Oh, that's, it doesn't matter. We're not going to be hurting for experience. Let's head back up. I want to go do some of these quests up here. Yeah, that's 200 rep for that one, so that's way better. Dragonflight's good. I really like Dragonflight. Does anybody? Yeah. I mean, don't know how many more times we can talk about it, to be honest. Infinitely. Oh, 
Oh yeah, this okay, I remember this quest now actually. We've done this more than once. It's gonna be tough. Especially with all those mobs around it. I guess not. It doesn't have that much health. It looks like it has a lot of health, but it doesn't actually. This is a problem. Just gotta have him keep threat. Somehow he's doing that perfectly. And we just gotta not let it die. I was hoping to leap out of the range of that, but didn't even come close because I kind of leaped up uphill a bit. Cut a few yards off the leap. Spell does 228 damage up front, which is more than any other spell I have, so pretty good. Old school spires, like a red ridge again here. Same color and everything. Pets dead? What? Wait, we finished that quest to, uh... Did we ever turn that in? Whatever happened with that? No, we gotta go turn that in. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. I think it's the webs that we need to kill. Yeah, because we're not getting anything from... I still have at least one AoE, though. Yeah, I think it's the webs. Oh, my bow just broke. What the fuck? I have many, many wares. Farewell, friend of the Grummels. We get back, because I don't... Don't want to have to kill everything again.
There's a rare there. Is that not the rare? No, that's not even one that's on the map there. That's weird. I don't fully understand this whole thing with rares in this game. In Dragonflight. Doesn't make a lot of sense to me. Oh, there we go. We finally got something from a non-web. I think the webs are just too useful because they drop like tons of them. So many enemies. Alright, well we actually finished it. So I'm not even going to bother with the rare. Probably killable, but not really interesting at this point. Come up to the end of the episode though. We'll go a little bit longer and go till about 10. There's this quest though. I don't know where. Wind tokens? I don't know what this part is. These are on the ground, I think, aren't they? Yeah. I remember doing this now. I had to do this to do the to level, I think. This was like part of the leveling recommendation from the guide that we followed. Supposed to be looking for him. No, it doesn't look like there's any over here anyway. Oh yeah, these guys need to be killed anyway. Part of a quest. Okay. Doing a woke quest as well. We'll do it. Sounds good to me. Lightning infused rock. <laughs> What's that? Whoa, the wind token. Hurt. This is really fun though. Hunter survival hunter is like nice. It's quite nice. I like the bombs, man. It's kinda cool seeing him get thrown. Lobbing that big bomb at him. I looked up at my buffs real quick and I was like, wait shit, I don't have an aspect on. Of course I don't. Another box there, test card tackle box. Pretty sure all these ones that are not marked get experience. Not that one. What's this? Looking for lunkers? Oh, what the hell? That's weird. A fish. Uh, don't really need that, but thanks. I haven't finished the scale. Got the first one on our first kill, and then not another one afterwards. And that Pat's looking scary, so let's just go ahead and trap it in advance because it's definitely going to intersect with us. Trap will actually stop it from patting, too, which is quite cool. Don't do that. This guy's got a lot of help. Hopefully he's gonna have a higher yield of his stuff too. Two of two on that, so now we just need, well, well, we're not even close to being done with this. Does this give anything that we w would want? It just gives experience, it's fine. I guess it probably gives rep too though, huh? No, it gives Dragon now. Alright, we're not doing this. Thanks anyway. So now we're just looking for more clickables. 
not fully aware of why it would say those things are wind tokens, but <laughs> fine by me, I guess. Last ones appear. Okay. But the flowers, should we go do that too? Are you good? Feed the elements. Oops. I mean, yeah, we're dead here. There's no, like, I don't have. No, I got one second. Oh, shit. Get it. These have to die. Okay, the pet's dead. This is really bad. All right, I don't think we can do this quest. Do I have a fucking slow or something? Okay, I got something further. First death. That's our actual first death of the playthrough. That's crazy. Hmm. Not uh, what I expected. What is this quest? I don't know that we can do that. Give it a try. Just need to kill the smaller ones faster, I guess. Are we gonna have to start over? I guess so. Let's see what happens. Yes. Goodbye. Use that now. We gotta pretty much use that on cooldown here. Okay, kill the smaller ones. Tap something. Didn't work. Turtle. Looks like this is probably the last one. I don't know why we only did three elements of three different types. What what element did we not get a fire elemental? No, that was the first one. So we never saw a water elemental. No, that was the we never saw air elementals. Oh, what the fuck? Oh my god. Didn't expect this. God, really? It's gonna keep splitting too, probably. It's a common thing with rock elementals. done I guess we are right because the quest is done yeah I, we probably didn't even have to fight those I don't know when the quest actually ended 
Fields of Ferocity is the... Here, let's go turn that in and then get that off our thing. And we can finish the Cirrus Flowers, too. This is the, like, Ring of Blood thing. What up? Keep it real. So we'll be that. It was worth turning in and give at least a little bit of experience. Then we'll finish this up and then we'll go down and hopefully, I mean, how close are we to being done here? Not close, but we haven't really have gotten a single quest done since those small ones before. I love the look of this character too, man. This character looks fucking awesome. Really satisfied with this if you haven't really seen it. It. There we go. It's good looking. Transmog goes really well with everything. Maybe a different color, like if I had like the red instead of the blue, it might go a little bit better with the torn totem thing on the back. But yeah, this will, uh, I probably could definitely, the way I normally do this is I try to do at least one a day, and then whenever I have a chance to do two a day, I can get ahead. So like once the series starts, I'm usually at least, because I can't record seven days a week anymore, so as long as I can get two made throughout the week extra, then I'm usually all right. But now, not only will we not be able to do Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, Tuesday through Friday, I mean, I won't even, yeah, and then I obviously won't be able to do the weekend too, so it's going to be like probably a week before another episode gets uploaded, I'd imagine. We'll see, I got it tomorrow, it's Tuesday, so I have to prioritize making videos for the main channel. Um... I just don't know like how, how well that's gonna go, I guess, at the end of the day. But yeah, even if I only made one, I need to make, probably need to make three. So even if I only made one, yeah, then that, that's just not enough days, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So yeah, won't really have any more time for this. Unless it goes so freaking well that I'm, I have an extra day or something, but I'm not even actually sure what time we're leaving Friday, though, so maybe... I doubt I would do this, but maybe I will try to get an episode done that day. Probably not, though. Well, look at you. Okay, that should have given a good chunk of rep, right? I don't know, maybe we're not going to actually finish this. Maybe I do need to go do the campaign. I think the campaign just gives way more rep. Have you eaten? I think that's 32 though. This gives 200 per. I mean, it's not, can't be much more than that, right? Oh, we're not actually fighting, we're just throwing it at the, uh, the enemies. I made a spear out of your own armor to penetrate you. That's, does that actually work that way? I guess so. I doubt it, to be honest. Maybe. I guess so. Yeah, well, it kind of indicates that, like, you've exhausted other options. Like, if an armored 
thing is strong enough to survive a bullet, then that must mean the armor is stronger than a bullet. So obviously, making a spear out of metal, the same metal you'd use to make a bullet, would be weaker. As such, just go ahead and make it out of the spear, the spear out of the, uh, the armor if you can. I don't know how you would though. That's how, you, how the hell are you gonna get a, a, like a scale off that mob? If that thing is strong enough to survive a bullet <laughs> and doesn't even impact it, then I don't know that you're gonna be able to rip a scale off it, right? And then come back like, all right, I'm back. I got the weapon now. Never, I serve Clan Shikar. Oh, and you like can, can control them there. Raise Hound. That's big time. Mm -hmm. This isn't going well. Turn to Mender, that's clever. So it does have some clever names over the years. For the questing experience. Are you good? Get some rest. Okay, we're gonna finish these quests and then I'm gonna end the episode. What's this guy for? Of stuff here. I don't know if I'm gonna have time to finish this. I'll make time though. Let's finish. I don't want to end on like a weird in the middle of a quest thing, especially if it's gonna be like a week before we record again. Let's aggro like five things. Oh wait, what? Those mobs are just gonna walk right by? What? That is very bizarre. Right now they're attacking. For some reason they're just like fully on the pet. There we go. <laughs> Things are acting more normal now. That was weird. Now dead. Pretty much just have to eat it and, and interrupt it. There's too little I can do without the pet. Oh, okay, we're aggroing more stuff. Or were we? I thought we were, but nope. Yeah, this works so well, dude. This is actually really good. This is up there with like the best hunter experience I've ever experienced. I mean, I would say this might actually be the best, to be honest. Classic's really, really cool because of the unique hunter stuff. But this is way more fun than Classic. I just need to do this naked. I should have did this naked. Naked with full talent points. That would have been, I think that would have been really, really cool. Or maybe then it becomes too easy. I don't think so though, because dude, range survival is not a thing. Like it's not ever gonna be a full power. It's crazy that we have to talk about being naked and not taking some talents. Or you know, not having a certain playstyle to make it work, but that's the power of leveling characters anymore, I guess.
Surprising hero's weapon, though. What is that? Got that from somewhere, but I don't know from where. It's too many enemies. <laughs> okay. Very convincing feign death. Legit too many enemies. This is crazy. How the fuck does this aggro? Oh, it didn't. Well, now it did. It just showed up and landed next to us. That was weird. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, this boat is kind of like a really kiss and curse kind of situation, man. Because it aggro's a lot of shit. Pretty much, like, everything. Yeah, like, literally everything. If it's near it, it's now fighting us. Including breaking our own traps. Which I'm shocked, because I didn't think it worked that way in PvE anymore. I thought if you CC'd, the enemy was immune to your AoE. I mean, we're gonna need all of it anyway, so I might as well just go. Totally, I don't know what the hell that was. It's like the spell didn't work for some reason. Oh yeah, those dogs that are padding. This is pretty nuts. I'm just randomly getting those from things, I guess. I don't even know from where. was a test. Be respectful. Probably one more quest, yeah. True. We did ding 24 though. Kill this, this guy with aggro before. Probably, oh yeah, it's definitely dying. I should probably try to pull threat. Yeah, I guess alright. dinged. Wait, there's more? Alright, I'm done. I'm gonna go here. Disgruntled initiate. That gives me an erupto. Hang on to that. 33, so we gain six levels today in two hours of play, so that's pretty good. Oh, is it a quest a uh, bonus objective or is it a world quest? Looks like a bonus objective. This is sacred land. Greetings. 
Okay. Good luck. Uh, should we just place these quick? That was the trial of the flood thing. All right. I just want to like stop at a place where it'll be obvious what I need to do to continue after I come back a few days. You. All right, perfect. Okay, cool. I'm gonna get out. Thank you for watching. I uh, hope you enjoy. We'll be back in a couple days, hopefully. I don't know when, but definitely be back soon, as long as the trip goes well. So thanks for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one.